If you're wondering what love but my heart and prayers go out to Athena's mom and her family or support feels like, then look no further than the front lawn of First Baptist Cottondale. Just overwhelming, all the candles and all the love. It's where thousands squeeze together along a small country road to remember Athena Strand Tuesday night. I don't know how to thank you guys for all that y'all have done for my family, but especially for my baby. It is where the mother of Athena spoke publicly for the first time since her little girl was taken from her last week. And I just want to keep her face and her story alive because I want everyone to know Athena for Athena and not for what someone tried to make her out to be. Because she's the best little girl. She really was. Photos of the first grader line the front of the stage as pink illuminated the night sky, Athena's favorite color, a Christmas angel placed on the stage representing the seven-year-old. He brought her into his heavenly home where there is no hate, where there is no hurt. This church where law enforcement volunteers and Athena's family regrouped during exhaustive search efforts. Every single one of my students plays an important role in our classroom family, and now we are missing one of those important people. Strand's teacher also spoke. They knew each other for only a few months, but this loving smile left a lasting impression. I now have 18 of my favorite six and seven year olds that are sad and hurting because they no longer have a friend and classmate. It's hard to put into words how much this community is hurting. Y'all are making me cry saying Athena strong, so I've I needed to be strong for her. Or how much this mother is hurting. But her one wish, her one request is simple as she and her family await justice. I don't care if it's five years from now, 10 years from now, 20 years from now, remember Athena Strand. Yeah, remember Athena Strand, that is the moving message from her mother this evening. The Wise County Sheriff giving us no new updates on the case that his office is building against the suspect involved in all of this. And you know, guys, the pastor here tonight said it so well. He explained why so many people came out here tonight, thousands coming out here to wrap their arms around Athena's family. He said that this could have been anyone's child. This could have been anyone's daughter here in this community. In Cottondale, I'm Matt Howerton.